from London Conjure and I'm here to introduce the first of many shows that London Conjure is about to produce and uh, these are a series of conversations where we talk about root work and Romani magic and a lot of different things that we use within London Conjure. <laughs> Sister Enable and I, um, we have known each other for a few years I think since 2005 and we've always had an ongoing conversation about spirituality and uh, workings. Both of us are part Romani Gypsy. Um, Sister Nabel has a uh, Creole and um, you know I we both have Native American on our side as well. Um, I'm Austri also Austrian, Russian, Polish, Hungarian and probably everything else that you can think of. Uh, but that's one of the reasons that we use so many deities is that we do have such rich backgrounds as well. And also when you're working with a lot of different people from a lot of different backgrounds, you want to work with uh, what makes them comfortable and also what is going to work for them. Um, so a lot of times we will work with uh, different deities from different religions and we will talk to elders and talk to other people within that community to make sure that we are doing things correctly within that community as well. So you'll be traveling around with me as I go through the places that we do a lot of the work, uh, including here over at the uh, sort of office. Uh, we'll also be talking about different uh, exes that we're working on as well. So you get a little bit of everything. You get a little bit of how we do things. Um, you get a little bit of the history behind it, a little bit of the lineage that we have, a little bit of the places that we travel to, and, um, you know, a little bit of the knowledge that we're going to share with you as well. So, you know, if you keep sticking with us every week, we're going to post one of these, and every week we'll have a different theme. And you just tune in, and we will explain it all. So we have the altar in back, and that's all lit up, and we have a bunch of jars and other things on it right now. So basically here we make all the oils, we make the baths, we make everything. This is where we pray over everything. office is uh, I go to the river quite a bit. We have some workings uh, and a lot of people you will probably know this. It's a honey jar and we do have a little bit of video of uh, us doing that. <laughs> do at the river are poppets or doll babies um, depending on where you come from but a lot of times we'll do the cleansings for them and the maintenance for them at the river as well um, and that's really important is keeping with the maintenance of the workings that you're doing and that we're doing um, and a lot of times we work in conjunction with the client so they're doing something and we're doing something at the same time <laughs> The nice thing about 
the age of technology is that we have YouTube and the web to actually look things up. And, you know, everyone is very much accessible these days. So if you have any questions, please feel free to contact us. So tune in next week and we'll be discussing a little bit of our influences, such as Marie Laveau. And also, uh, I'll be taking you over to Roosevelt Island and I'll be explaining a little bit of the history and how that inspires us and how that helps with uh, doing root work. Um, and especially when you have clients that are dealing with difficult spirits or lost spirits or uh, spirits that have had something traumatic happen to them. So, see you next week. Thank you.